with High Captain Kurth now dead, and that I have his seal to give to Aaron Gend. I could be on my way towards the host tower of the Arcane right now to find answers to this business with the cult. But I decided to kill the other High Captain as well. Why? No, not out of any sense of altruism. But it's just the fact that I want his loot, and to kill another fool who has been sending his men after me while in the city. In truth, it bothers me that he agreed to free those nine children he had to me in bad faith, since all nine were already dead or changed into were-rats. If he had told me this from the beginning, then I might feel better disposed towards him. But the fact that he betrayed the agreement by lying to me about freeing them. Now I just want to see this lying scum dead like the other High Captain. An agreement is an agreement, and he broke it. So now I deliver justice in the only way one can in a city without justice. There's no leaders or magistrates or guards here to enforce the law. So he must pay with his life in this chaos of a city. See, this is my opportunity. Now we have sewers to scour for the rest of the levers to this fantabulous contraption machine that makes potions from... from... Uh, <laughs> sewer water. It sounds disgusting to be sure, but I'd like to see this thing work. Gnomes. They all seem to be like this, the strange little fools. They always focus on this machine or that contraption, and nearly every time it doesn't work. And if it happens to work, it completely gives unexpected results. Soon enough, I'll get to the reason why the cult was here in Luskin, and then hopefully I can eliminate them and conclude my business in this region and return home. I can already recall the smells of the incense, the sight of the palace, the better food with actual spices for flavor, and the beautiful women of my Erebar already. As you can see, yes, I am homesick. We've rested, we've returned. It's time to kill some undead and some fool that calls himself the High Captain. Undead and were rats, that's who this High Captain is all about. shadows down already. This is going to be a lot of fighting to get through, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm not looking forward to the joint pain afterwards, so... Is that one casting spells? Kill it quickly. Oh, you're a were rat that casts spells, are you? Let's heal you up some. Good enough. Potion of Antidote. What's over here? Crate, see? They do trap crates. Come and disable this trap. It's done. Bullet unidentified. It's a small shield. Looks enchanted. Yeah. Let's sell that. Healer's kit. Nice one. Now what's this? Book piles. healer's kit. All right. Two pathways. Did we come we came from up there, did we? Oh 
Okay. No, we came from here. That's the exit. Alright, then let's go this way. Oof. Ghouls everywhere. Alright. Where's that flail? Tough one. Where'd it go? Each group seems to be led by a tougher one. You've been diseased. Ah, uh, I did buy extras. There you go. Hey, let's keep on killing these ghouls. Stairs going down. Well, let's go this way. Don't know if this is the right way to get to the High Captain Barum. Another gate. Seems to be it. Alright, time to switch. Terms of treasure going through here. We're rats. Ah, trap. You can't defeat us. Tommy, where'd you go? Wow. Here comes Halfling Dead.
<laughs> you take a lot of healing. Good enough. They were tough enemies. Another exit to some other area. I have no idea what's down there. What's this way? What is it? Ghouls. Keep switching back and forth with my weapons. Going could be empty. Ah. More ghouls. Here they come. this way. Looking for those levers. He said it was in the sewers. I don't know if this is the correct sewers or not, though. Ooh, skeletons. Alright. Oh, they're very tough, actually. Tommy, the fool. We're in for a bit of a fight. Pray, whatever gods you worship. Those two-headed swords of theirs can be very dangerous, especially if there's a group of them. I was just hurt. Where'd you go, spider? Oh, you killed it. Alright, let's get out of here. Time to retrieve the little one. Yes, yes, let's go. Let's rest. Alright, we're back. This goes up to the surface somewhere, I take it. It's a large area. Where are you, High Captain? Where are you? Oh, it's trapped. Ah, uh, it's done. More ghouls. I love this part. Join in death, huh? Not yet. Not yet. There. 
What's over here? There's a door. Ah, no kind of ah. fine. Keep going. Ooh, where'd they come from? Oh, the fleshlings, they will find my shiny. You're not going to attack? What are you? No hurts! No hurts! Me needs to speak to the living flesh! Needs to speak! Uh, Alright, creature. Speak quickly, what do you want with me? Me needs the flesh to find the amulet. It has great power. Me needs it. But my brother, he keeps it from me. You gets me the amulet, yes? Me rewards you? Gives you many pretties? Hmm. What do you mean by your brother? What is this amulet? Brother was brother when we were flesh. When we becomes ghoul, he steals my precious amulet. Steals it. All my powers from when I was flesh it has. Me wants it back. You gets and me rewards you. You helpless flesh, you helps. Hmm? Huh. I might consider helping you. You can't see Amulet from brother. Me rewards you. You kills him or... No, me not care. Me needs Amulet. Why don't you just get it yourself? Brother, he uses Amulet. He creates ghouls from the humans of city above. Many ghouls! Maybe that explains why you're all here. Too many ghouls for me to take what is mine! You takes it for me! Why do you need this amulet so badly? It has all power for when me was flesh! Without it, me has no power! None! What reward do I get out of this? Me has pretties hidden away! Hidden goods you not find! Shiny pretties, a key, and something else. Hmm. Fine, I'll do it. It's good. Get amulet. Kills brother. Brings amulet to me. I'll go now. Yes, go. Brings it to me. That is a horrible voice. I never want to hear it again. I just kill it just for the sake of it. All right, this thing wants an amulet from his brother. I take it his brother's a ghoul. Killed so many. Oh, Are you the brother? How will I know the brother? Still haven't found any levers. What? Where are they coming from? They just appear behind us. things. They're like the zombies in the graveyard section of the city of Neverwinter. A bunch of more ghouls coming up. Make sure they trap these sections. Ooh, this one looks even more powerful. Alright. He 
these are this is a powerful one war domain powers Kill it. Tommy. I need one too. This is bad. Kill this thing. Spider. Here comes Halfling Dead. Oh, that wasn't that difficult. I am hurt, though. Was that his brother? I have no idea. You can stay diseased for now. I'm saving the last one for myself. Amulet of power, magic rod. I take it this is what that ghoul was looking for. This amulet has obviously seen better days. Its face is cracked and caked with grime and tarnish, and the metal is dented in many places. Obviously it has been gnawed on extensively. Whatever the amulet once was, it still seems to hold some of its power and has subdued reddish glow when worn. Magic rod. Can't identify it. All right, what did I write down in my journal? Amulet, okay. I seem to have found what it, that other ghoul that talks was looking for. Check for traps. Tommy. Ooh, great axe. Ah, found a lever. We just need one more. One's part of it. Gold. There's four levers. One is already attached to it. Where would that lever be, though? We've got to return to this section here. Faced enough ghouls. I'm a little tired of them. Alright, let's get back to the other side. Not that I want to hear this thing again. The voice is horrible. Have you the amulet? Did you find it? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I have the amulet right here. Yes, the amulet is mine again. Not so fast. The reward. Ah, yes, me gets the pretties. Here you takes the shiny keys and shiny stick that me finds pretties. Now me takes amulet is mine. Hmm. That works for me. You have a lever. Me goes now. You stays away, flesh. Me meets again. Me not so nice. Let's go. Leave the creature to itself. I have all the amulets now. Or the levers. Well, there's an exit up there. Let's go to the other side then. Let's go way up way up that way. We've made it. <clears throat> I have no idea where this leads, so Oh, that out. 
We were going after Barum. Let's go back up there. The sewers are right there. That's where we went in originally. We went the other way last time. Ah. Your soul shall be mine! Not today, Wanty. This is a tough one. Good job, Tommy. Parchment on it. What does it say? This lengthy sheet of aged and yellowed parchment contains several complex drawings annotated in a strange language. The impression one gets at a glance is that the contents involve some form of necromantic ritual. On the reverse side is written the following. Sisters of the Night, it falls on you to see the ritual through that will provide Barum with the army he requires. This Akhamic ritual will infuse the bones of the long buried with the spirits of the mourned and form a powerful mummy construct. Barum should be pleased with the results. So long as you read the words of the ritual, you will be protected from harm. Hmm. Allow nothing to distract you. Ensure that the skeletal priests continue their worship unhindered and that the tablets remain intact or your ritual will be worthless. Success will bring you great status within the new order, so you are promised. It is signed with one name, Mogram, from the cult. Mogram has influenced both sides. We need to stop the priests from singing or performing the ritual, whatever they're doing. More were-rats. <laughs> Ow! Last one. doing in this corner. We need to go rest again. Let's go. Back in good form. Let's kill us. A high captain. We still have to find out that potion making machine. Something over here. No doubt this is going to be a bit of a challenge. Ah, yes. Your powers are feeble against the powers of Shar, weakling. I greet you. Nothing can touch us, fool. Prepare for death. I greet you. All right, then. My weapon will not... Ha! Ah. They're trying to create a mummy. Where's this mummy? My weapon's ineffective. Not good. I have to be able to kill this necromancer. Gods you worship. Ah, the hells. To the hells with you. What do the parchments say? Keep it busy for a moment. Ah, a 
Akamic ritual will infuse the bones of the long buried with the spirits of the mourned. Yes, yes, yes. So long as you read the words of the ritual, you will be protected from harm. Allow nothing to distract you. Ensure that the skeletal priests continue their worship unhindered. These are not skeletal priests. But that might be. The single minus spirit continues on its way past me towards a place in the distance. Ah. They're ignoring me. Maybe it's not being done in this room. Tommy, you're going to die if you stay here. Okay, I interrupted it. Flesh ones must die! That worked. Alright. A little bit better help. Oh. Powerful mummy has come. We're hurting it. Kill it, kill it. Come on, Tommy, keep at it. It's down. I guess we kill this mummy too. What's going on behind me? Soul shall be mine. Kill it. We can hurt it now. Here comes Halfling Death! Whatever that thing is, it hits really hard. <sighs> Got to kill that one T over there. Ah! Got it. Time to get out of here. Strength. Yes, yes, yes. Time to rest. All right, we've returned. I don't know. 
know, maybe it was the one T that was hurting us. There's <sighs> a lot of fighting. Who's this spirit corpse? These tools. Useless. What's this do? Nothing. Nothing that I can determine about this sarcophagus. Look for traps. Okay, ducky. Locked. Little bit of gold. Out of the way, spider. Nothing here. Okay, let's go back into that room. What's in these remains? Knuckle bone. Battle axe, skeleton knuckle. More zombies. The rubble here. There's chest on over there. Yeah. Kill these things. Whatever gods you worship. me. Guard me. Okay, duck. Locked. Bullets. What's this remains? Ah, Necromancer's journal. Kill her. Ah. Let's go to the other side. Got my own spider to help. It's here. Some gold. That's all it is, is rituals being performed down here. Who's this? Greetings! Huh. Aye, Ill Matters Mercy! Where am I? What, what's this place? Hmm. Who are you? How did this happen? Me? My name is Miriam. These... Oh, my. The spiders. I... I remember. It... It... I... It's horrible, horrible. All the children gone. Children? You mean Londa's children? Yes, yes. You know of them? I... I am their nanny. It was horrible. He... The High Captain, he took the children from Miss Lanta's home. He threw me to these spiders and... and... She starts crying. He had the bigger children turned into... to creatures like himself. The... the smaller ones he gave to the other creatures to... to... Continues crying. All of... dead. All of them. This... this is all I have left of them. Fine, fine, Miss Lanta, give it to her. Tell her I tried to save them. It was no use. I shall try. I cannot face Miss Londa. Not after... Not after that. I've just got to get out of this place. Th th thank you for freeing me, my lord. But I must go. Get out of here. Alright, let's get to the other side of this place. There's also a door on the far side of this room. What's going on over here, though? Might be another mummy. Ah! Trap. can't seem to hurt that. But we can hurt these. I love this part! 
feared that shadow. What's going on in this room? I need to restore my strength. Keep at it. It's falling apart. It's, it's done. Alright. What kind of damage can we do in here? A transmitter tablet? These stones vibrate with energy. They seem to be powering something. Altar of bone, huh? Destroy them. It stopped. Let me destroy this one too. Yep, I knew I was going to start using this one. And I destroy this altar. Seem to do anything. What's this? A bag on the floor. Greater restoration. What's going on with this thing? It's acting different. I think we just shut it off. Okay, so restoration. Here. Nope. I think we shut their ritual down. Let's go back in the chamber and see if we can't kill that one T. Your soul shall be mine. I, I can hit her now. Not serve here. Ha! I don't know if we're even hurting her, actually. Kill these zombies. Can you hit her? the other one on the other side. What if I use? Ah! Doesn't seem to be doing anything. She can't be invincible. Ah! Ah! It was so strange. Yes, enough of that. Let's rest and return. Hmm. Your soul shall be mine! Not this again. There has to be a way to kill her. She's injured. She's bleeding. Kill it! Finally. The witch is dead. Key. I take it this opens the door. In this room. What can I do? They're trying to summon the ultimate zombie, are they? I don't know. We fought a really powerful one in the other room. Let's see if there's a trap here. 
Okay, okay. Ah. Ah, it's done. A little bit of gold. Well, the summoning ritual is now over. Let's see what's in here. Ah, I got this book. That's right. Perhaps I should read it. Or maybe we already destroyed the threat that this would be talking about. Let's read this. This small, leather-bound journal is filled with notes written in a hurried and almost indecipherable script. Most of them seem to relate to the complex creation of some kind of gargoyle statue that will bestow magical power upon the necromancer's ally, who, by the description, is undoubtedly Barum. One of the last notes reads, The latest statues have been fired and inscribed with all the proper runes. Our ally wishes to use them immediately, even though we have warned him that they will be very fragile until they have had time to properly set. He is far too impatient. Now we're going to deal with powerful gargoyles. There's only one room left down here. Ah! Is that... It's Barum's men, but... He's not here. You'll find your death here! Better than you have fallen before me! Here comes Halfling Death! Here comes Hopper! You'll find your death! It's locked. Ha. Huh. Unlock it. Good. Get that after. here. No magical bullet. What's this remains? Topaz. Gold. Gold. Light cure light wounds. Kind of useless. Stop moving, Tommy. Nothing there. Nothing there. Is that him? I think that's him. There's a trap here. Disable it. Ah, uh, it's done. Nothing here. Well, I guess I will take all the potions I can. I found some more bark skin potions. Potion of clarity. You will not survive. Ah, bark skin. He's coming. The gulls will pick at your corpse by morning. All right, potion of speed. Ouch, take this. Ah. 
Your stone skin is gone now. Oh, it's back. I will see you. He's almost down. There goes the spider. Got him. A good hit. Kill the priestess. And that's the end of High Captain Barum. There's his head. Helmet unidentified. Potion of visibility. Enchanted dagger. Morning star. It's a leather type armor. All right, another fool down. What's this? Gargoyles, masks, shield. Come. There's traps here. Oh, disable that. Okay, of course, it's locked. I assume he was going to activate these things if we had come into the room with him. Ah, uh, it's done. Bracers. Hmm. Potion antidote. I wonder if these bracers are superior to what I'm wearing. No, I'm wearing gauntlets of ogre power. I'd rather keep that than something for defense. A little bit more offense on my part. Okay, unlock this. Uh, it's done. Gold. It's in this chest. Okay, ducky. Yeah, unlock that. Gold. Ooh. High Captain Seal. So now we have both. Locked. Unlock that sarcophagus. Uh, it's done. Cure critical wounds. And there's a corpse over here. Another cure critical wounds. came in. Alright. We've done enough. Let's go look for that uh, contraption that makes potions. That's the only thing left here in the city to do other than getting our rewards. And going off to see the uh, host tower of the arcane. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.